Then we're gonna do a couple forehand throws. Backhand goes across the body this way. Forehand comes from the outside of the body uh, this way. And we're gonna just throw with different fingers. So the first one is your traditional forehand grip. And that's the first two fingers going on the inside of the rim. Thumb is going on top of the flight rings and you're pinching in between these fingers here. Your palm is gonna stay up towards the sky and you're bringing the frisbee back towards the outside of your elbow. So it's in this little notch right here of your thumb and coming back this way. I'm gonna stand square facing where I wanna throw, step out to the side. And all I'm doing is going from here to here and pointing towards my target. I just wanna to try to see if I can get it to spin once or twice and keep my palm up. If I can get it to spin once or twice and go towards my partner, with my palm up, pointing right to them, then that's really good. To make it go a little bit further or faster, I just do this quicker. So I just snap my hand forward, I get a little more spin on the frisbee, and that will go a little further. So the second forehand throw is called a thumber, and we do the same type of action, but instead of sending it with the first two fingers, you're gonna send it with your thumb. That's why I call it thumb. So what I do is put the frisbee on my forearm, Fingers are on the outside of the frisbee, thumb is on the inside of the frisbee this way. And all I'm doing is going from thumb pointing backwards to thumb pointing towards the side. So on top of my forearm, thumbs underneath, fingers are on top, and I'm just going thumb to stell. If I keep my palm up, then it will stay flat. If I let my palm if I let my palm come up this way, then it won't be level to the ground. It's going to curve or hit and roll. Uh, so we want to try to keep that palm up. 